I need to stop one cutting boys. <laughs> or oh, I'm gonna fucking end it. I've got fourteen point four million wood cutting XP and no pet. It's it's not happening, boys. It's not happening. Why is it not happening? It's what a fucking little beaver there. That's all I'm asking for. A little beaver, boys. Why do I record so late? I don't get it. Well, I do get it. I work late, don't I? I don't want to keep people awake next door, you know? <laughs> Why am I whispering? I don't normally care, but like, I'm, I know that like, one day I'm gonna... <laughs> Someone's lying there, right? Like a child. <laughs> hearing me at like, <laughs> two in the morning. <laughs> introing a video. <laughs> just like, through the walls. <laughs> He's probably just like, I wanna go to sleep. <laughs> This guy's fucking talking about doing monkey madness at 2am. But if walls did their job, then I wouldn't have to worry. Welcome back to Twunk. Twank. Welcome back to Twank. Which is the fucking most horrible abbreviation I could have come up with. It's really hard to say. It feels unnatural to say. It sounds like I got a lisp. And abbreviating things is like the new RuneScape creator's better thing to do now. So... Right, I should probably go set it up. I, probably, I should probably go set up the, the, the episode, right? I'm gonna set up the monkey badness. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna get a thing that I can't talk, boys. I need to get. It's all this wood coin. I'm fucking brain dead. It takes a while for my brain to turn back on. <sighs> Have a sip of Vimto. That'll sort you out. Do Americans know what Vimto is? Most Americans have never heard of Vimto. Kool Aid is perhaps the nearest US equivalent. A Vimto doesn't have a mascot or anything. It's because we're British. We don't need mascots. Well, it is Vimto. Fuck it. Drink it or don't drink it. Do you think I give a shit? Just fucking drink it or not. I don't care. <laughs> That's what every advert's like in England. <laughs> Monkey Madness 1 Quest, boys. Let's get everything we need. I've gone back to woodcutting. It's automatic. I don't even mean to do it anymore. I'm just... It's all, it's imprinted in me. Right, we got we got everything we need. We we've got everything in the monkey tab. Everything that we need, apparently. Let's start, boys. I said last video that I'd never done this quest before. That was a complete lie. I did this quest back when RuneScape three was old school RuneScape. Maybe not that far back. It's probably like 2009, 2010. Let me let me quickly figure this out. How old was I? Let's say, let's just say how old how old was I? Thirteen. Let's say thirteen. Jeez, I'm such an old man. That was thirteen years ago. Shit, wait. 13? I was 13 in... Wait a minute. Come on, Jack, you can do this. Simple maths. 2006! No, that'd be 12. 2007? Somewhere around there. So yeah, this is when RuneScape was old school RuneScape. When... Shit, man. I'm old. <laughs> but since then, I haven't done it, so... WARNING! <laughs> it's big like... WARNING! Ape Toll is one of the... I'm keeping that kid awake, 100%. Like... He's hearing that through his fucking, through his fucking walls. Apetal is one of the most dangerous areas in the game until you obtain a, obtain a monkey gree gree. Great way to start a quest, boys, with an actual warning. Love it. The quest is divided into four chapters. Yay! So he's like doing four quests in one. I didn't even say what music trap we're going to lock. Boys, we're unlocking anywhere. It's the only thing on the A's. On the first page of A's anyway, because yeah, we got this other. We're probably gonna unlock it at the beginning of the quest. But if you remember the rules, go back to the rules, boys. If it's a quest, we're gonna do the whole thing because I'm lazy and I don't do this shit. Monkey Madness Chapter One. Yeah. I'm supposed to be trying to find out what's going on, right? By reading all this. Nah, I'm just gonna read. If I read what's happening on the quest log, I'll know what's going on, right? Start Monkey Madness. Yes, thank you. Enter the shipyard north of the gliding site and talk to talk with Glow Canner. Why can't I read, man? Am I dyslexic or something? I don't think so. I think I'm fine. I think it's just because it's late. Do you ever just read something and you're like, I read it, but I don't know what it just said? That's how I feel like most of the time. <laughs> when do I get to Apertal and start smashing monkeys around the head? That's what I'm really excited for. Right, back to talk to the king, because the gnome doesn't trust me. Right, apparently Dario is some bloke who's the new head tree guardian. I don't, I don't know what that is. I'm not, I'm not involved in this little world. Near the blueberry bar. Great. Where the fuck's the blueberry bar? They're giving me instructions like I know this place like the back of my hand when I don't. Look at his chin. That is a glorious chin, man. That is crimson chin levels of chinness going on right there. Oh, what well, boys? I unlocked a track without even knowing technology. Who's the fucking noob now? Who's unlocking one track an episode now, mate? Didn't think so, but he didn't think you were going to be there, did you? I remember you. Try two tracks this episode, boys. Yeah. 
Yeah. I'm such a prick. <laughs> oh my god, moves left, 195. Eee! Solving the puzzle. Pfft, skip over that. It should just be one step, get rune light. Wait, am I allowed to do that, by the way? Is, is that... Is that legal? For, to Jagex, so have, have I got to blow that out? I, I don't use rune light. I just use... Your thing. It's a complete lie. I don't think I've ever actually launched the old school RuneScape launcher before. <laughs> Alright, speak to these blokes. What now? Right, we're sailing to Apatol, boys. Fuck me. The oh, boys! Lad, second track unlocked. Sell me to Apatol, you little midget. I am under direct orders to remain here. You're not under orders. <laughs> As he has conflicting or Oh. <laughs> I I'm getting ahead of myself. The workers are getting restless, Karanok. I know. If you want me to uh, do, um, read your audio books for you, I'm uh, I'm free for booking. Uh, it's only ten pound an hour. Uh, I'll, I'll, read, I'll, I'll read your books for you, boys, because I have to. I've got this voice that just it just it soothes people. All this talk of Gloth being replaced doesn't bode well for. How shall I put this? Their morale. I don't know what they're about. Let's just skip over it. I can't be asked, boys. Chapter 2, in which our hero finds themselves engaging in severe quantities of monkey business. Severe quantities of monkey business. That's exactly where I want to be. Recommended high healing food, a form of poison, blah, 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 blah. Get myself some food and then get back in. Activate protect from missiles as you travel north as a volley of poisoned arrows will start in you as you reach close to the Apazol gate. You'll be knocked out and placed in prison. Wow. I'm crying, apparently. <laughs> My guy, you can't, you can't have it anymore. Oh, boys. One lost another track. Why is my guy still crying? Is he gonna get up? <laughs> Stay one square away from the northern cell wall near the patrolling guard's path. If the guards are in front of it, or else they will punch you for 10 to 20 damage. Fuck you, hell, man. Getting punched by monkeys now. He's leaving. He's leaving. Come on, mate. Yes. Oh, shit, no. No! No, he's gonna punch me, boys. Don't punch me. <coughs> How's he not see me? This fucking bamboo. Like, he can, he can, he's literally probably looking. Oh, my God. Stop attacking me. Eee, run away. How did he not see me? He looked right at me. Speak with Garcor. Make sure you go all the way through the dialogue to the point where he tells you to meet Zuknok. I swear they just fucking... Enter a bunch of random letters into a generator until a name pops out. Continue west, behind the buildings in the grass until you reach a doorway to your north. Fuck, I hate directions. I'd be shit. It's good job Google Maps is a thing now. Because fucking hell, man. If I had to pull up to someone and be like, yeah, where's this? And like, oh, yeah, head north, then west, through the grass, and then east. I'd be like, mate, I, you lost me at north, mate. Wait, what the fuck is. Talk to Sleeping Monkey? Wait, but he's not sleeping. Or is he the monkey that puts you to sleep? Is that his job? Right, where are the dentures? Because I'm, all I'm finding is fucking needles. And thread. There we go. <coughs> there we go. Travel to the northwest part of the cabin and search a crate to find a mamulet mold. Witch crate. <laughs> it's fucking hundreds of them. <gasps> oh, yes, there we go. First, the second one, boys. There we go. It's recommended to teleport out on bank at this point. The zombie monkeys pose a significant nuisance. I love how these guides are here, man. A significant nuisance as they will hit you while you are running past. The whole dungeon is a multi-combat area, of course. Because it, it, it would be fun unless it was multi-combat, would it? The real threats are the gorilla skeletons. Oh no, that's the real threat, boys. Don't even worry about the zombie monkeys. It's the fucking gorilla skeletons. They're densely packed and hit accurately and quite hard, up to 12. Did I unlock anywhere yet, by the way? I still haven't unlocked anywhere yet. I've been in Apatol. Why are you not giving me the track? The player will occasionally be hit by rocks, indicated by the screen and rumbling noise. The rocks can be avoided by sheltering under the numerous overhangs, but can be largely ignored. They're just rocks. They're just clonky on the head. Fine, boys. Clonk on the head. Bit of a dent in your head. Get back up, boys. Fine. Get back up. You're fine. Walk it off. So those monkeys have arms like that fucking guy from Street Fighter. I'm not even near them and they're slapping me on the head. Fucking tickling me from halfway across the room. Right, 
What are we doing? Then use your mamulet, your gold bar, and your monkey dentures on him. Make sure you're given an enchanted bar before leaving the tunnel. Right, what are we doing now? Please say we've unlocked the track. No, we have not. Right, we've got some fucking dirty go fucking gold bar in our in our bag. Uh, I I, boys, I don't know what we're doing at this point. I think we're turning ourselves into a monkey. I don't even know. Okay, teleport on bank if necessary. Return to Ipsol afterwards and continue northwest until you're placed in a jail cell again. Yay, we're going back to monkey jail. That's what I've been waiting for. Oh, let me get back into monkey jail so I can fucking get punched in the face by a fucking gorilla. Go, 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 go. Oh, no, I just ran into his fat ass. <laughs> Move. How did no one spot me? I was just behind him, trying to bomb him. And nobody even cared. Oh my god, right. What, what am I doing in here? And swiftly use the enchanted bar on the wall of flames. I love when it throws shit like this at me, because I have... Why is there a wall of flames? Head to the building west of the jail. Right, okay. Oh shit, I'm just running straight out into the fucking monkeys! <laughs> That was some fast prayer action there, Jack, and you don't even use the F1 keybinds. To the west of that building, there should be a banana garden that has a monkey child in it. Oh god, where's this going? The monkey child has been patrolled by the monkey's aunt. Do not enter the banana garden when the monkey's aunt is present, or she will call the guards to arrest you. Tell the monkey child you are his uncle. Okay, where's this going, boys? I don't like it. I think we're about to molest the monkey child. E! Oh my god! Fucking ninjas after me, leave me alone. Sneak over here. Oh my god, that monkey is relentless. He really wants me. Oh my god. Oh my god! She's coming! Ah! <laughs> Fucking nearly caught me touching a kid. I mean, talking to a kid. Not touching him. Give me your amulet before I chop you in half and take it off, you dead corpse. Yes, all right. I need some monkey bones to make a gree gree because I'm going to turn myself into a monkey. I think that's genuinely what's happening. Right, we've got the stuff we need. We're doing part three now. I think we're actually making a gree gree, I think. So we've got to travel through that really long fucking tunnel again, which is, you know, it was so fun the first time. They thought, let's make it, let's make a comeback because the first one did so well. Ratings were so high. Right, I think we got the monkey gree gree. Chapter three. Monkey Bandage chapter three. I'm a monkey. I'm a monkey. <laughs> right, okay, chapter three. And we're a monkey. Look at that. He's monkey time, boys. Look at me, lads. Oh, yes. Look at him go. That is a man who is free. He's free to do what he wants. Here we go. We're in. We're in, boys. We've got the king where we want him. Take him down. Take it down, boys. Take him down. He will ask you to rescue a monkey from the Ardorn Zoo. Oh shit, right, oh right, that's what I remember. Oh shit, I got a monkey poke. That hurt. Why is that even an option? Travel by foot to the gnome str oh, what? What? Any method of teleportation will result in the monkey leaving your inventory. You little bitch! Oh, it's quarter past two and this quest still isn't done. <laughs> I was kinda of hoping to do more than just one quest tonight, to be honest. Return to Apatol. Speak to the king again. The monkey will automatically leave your backpack and we'll give a consider an alliance. Speak to Garka again to start chapter four. Fucking hell, man. Last chapter. And, oh my god. That's why I just want to go bed. The monkey's going to pop out. He's going to pop out, boys. He's going to twirl out of the bag. He's going to do a little uh, exit like on the uh, the Restless Ghost quest. Nope, he just pops out. That's boring, isn't it? Oh my god. Another cutscene that I'm not going to read out. Right, it's time to fucking kill a jungle demon. That's all you've been waiting for. The video's probably been like 15 minutes of me just doing absolute nonsense. Have we unlocked the Anywhere track yet? Oh my god, we have. Thank god. We could have stopped this ages ago, but we're following the rules. Oh shit, there's a fucking earthquake going on, boys. I added my own sound effect there. Did you like that? Because I don't have, don't have the sound on. Oh, here he is. He's straight out, boys. There we go. Oh shit. Oh my god. I forgot. I forgot my weapon. Now we're ready, boys. Okay, round two, boys. Round two, round two. Ding, ding. Get it, get it going. Fire? What are you doing? Fucking fire, you stupid cannon. Didn't even work. I got a broken one, boys. You got a dud. I bought a dud cannon. I bought a dud cannon, boys. Fuck it. I'm going to run in and attack the cunt. 
You're all attacking him. Come on, someone, someone jump him in the Achilles heel. Take him down. Someone grab his horn. Someone jump on his back and stab him in the spine. You boys are doing nothing. Look, he's just walking about. He's just walking about like he's at, like he's at work. Me and this little twat here, who's just fucking jabbed him once, and he's like, nah, I'm done. That's my job done, boys. I'm off. See you in a bit. Oh, we just threw a shoe at him. All right. Oh, and this cannon. Great work. I want to give a medal to the cannon that didn't fire a single cannonball. You did great, boys. You did great. You did great, lad. Congratulations on being the worst cannon ever. Is he going to die or what? Wow, okay. So I have to deal with the last blow. Boys, why don't you stop attacking him for a minute? Oh my god, is this actually happening? Is this actually happening? Teleport out. Teleport out, Jack. Come back another day. Holy shit. I don't need the intro every time, boys. All right? It's fine. I, I know what's happening. I'm fighting a fucking demon. Give him the final blow. Yes. Oh my god, it's done. Finally. Oh my god. This quest was an absolute bitch. Oh my god. But it's finally done. I've been putting it off for so long. And that kid next door can finally sleep in a minute. If I let him. I might just run around the house naked for a while. Wait, why naked? Got a few diamonds. Classic. Oh, we got 85 hit points, boys. We did get a level up. Very nice. The ability to buy and wield the dragon scimitar. Right. I need to find Dagger. He looks like a little monkey doctor. <laughs> Is it just me or does he look like a monkey doctor? You mean he put a stethoscope on him, he's a monkey doctor, right? <laughs> oh, <laughs> getting moist just looking at it. Dragon Battle Axe, step aside. Look at that, man. Look how sexy that is. Oh, my God. And before we go, we're going to quickly check what the requirement for the next one is. The next music track, boys. Arachnids, Arachnids of Vampirium. This track unlocks in the Theater of Blood. Wow, really? But is this going to be like the 95 Slayer thing? I think you can just spectate with the Theater of Blood. Next episode, it's going to be spectating, boys. Architects of Prifidus. Do I even want to know? In Prifidinus. Prifidinus. Yeah, that's not going to be happening for a while, boys. Song of the Elves. I think a little bit off the requirements there, boys. Just a little, only a little bit. Is that all you got? Is that all you got? Is that all you got?